Right now, the Wayne County Sheriff's Office is investigating the deadly shooting of an off-duty corrections officer killed in Detroit. Let's send things out to our Sean Lay, who joins us now live this afternoon with a look at what we're learning. Sean. We're learning a lot more. That's the under sheriff of the Wayne County Sheriff's Office, Mike Jafar, briefing us right now. We'll be heading over there to see what he has to say. Here's what we've learned so far this morning, however, from the sheriff's office. We're talking about an off duty corrections officer from the Wayne County Jail. His name is Devonte Jones. I can tell you Devonte was well known and well loved in his Detroit community. He was only 23 years old and again, a corrections officer with Wayne County off duty very early this morning. The sheriff's office tells us Officer Jones was dropping someone off at the the apartments on East Forest and the Chrysler Service Drive. You'll see a black Dodge Durango in your video. That's Jones SUV. We could see several bullet holes in the door of that Durango and shots shots also were fired into a woman's black Impala. Officer Jones tried to get away from the person shooting. He ran from the area but was later found and he died of those gunshot wounds at 448 this morning at Detroit Receiving Hospital. We're also expected to get an update from Detroit Police. They're the agency handling this homicide case. We'll have much more coming up at 5 o'clock with the Sheriff's Office has to say. The people who love Devontae Jones for sure and Detroit Police are now looking for a killer. Back to you. Oh, such a tragedy. Sean, thank you for the update there. Also making headlines this afternoon, police say a body discovered Sunday in Wyoming is believed to be Gabby Petito. The cause of death has not been determined just yet, but you might remember Petito disappeared while on a cross country trek with her fiance, who has been identified as a person of interest. The FBI searched his family's home today in Northport, Florida, and authorities are currently searching for him.